angry. And I'm hurt. I'm disappointed and I, I feel all alone. Tell me, what's the point of living this life when I feel it worthless? I'm done taking the back seat. It's time for me to drive. So today, I'm taking this gun and I'm freeing my soul. And as he stands with that gun to his head, he looks in the mirror and remembers all the words that were said. Punk, fool, lame, black. Small, weak, ignorant, irrelevant, nigga. These words constantly on his mind because there hasn't been a place or time that had crossed the line and called him outside of his name. But the crazy thing is that I don't like the power that they possess. You see, it's the words they said that started this mess. You see, words are dead. They're buried beneath our tongue. But the moment we get them, speak them into existence, we get the power, life, and authority. We don't worry about the damage because we assume there's warranty. So don't let these words play with his mind. Words him with a one-two combo, lowering his self-esteem. But since he's a one-man team, nobody can hear his screams. Words him with a jab, a rabbit and punch. All you hear is a spirit crunch. Too weak to fight back, too weak to even care. Too weak to comprehend, too weak. The fight no longer seems fair. But his soul cries every time his soul tries to not the reason why his soul dies. But is this the reason why? But these words play no games throughout change around his brain, living his dreams, and destroying his destiny, leaving him saying, I am angry. And I'm hurt. I'm disappointed. And I, I feel all alone. Tell me, what's the point of living this life if I feel worthless? I'm done taking the backseat. It's time for me to drive. So today, I'm taking control. I said, today, I'm taking control. Today, I'm taking this gun. And I'm freeing my soul. Giant raindrops fall from his eyes, and hurricane winds gush from his mouth, and treacherous blood flows through his nose. And as you can see, his feelings are being exposed. He dangerously drifts in a downward direction, yet he fearfully floats in what seems like forever. But right before he pulls the trigger, he hears a voice say, you are beautifully and wonderfully made. Amen. And much pain comes to the wicked, but the one who trusts in the Lord will have everlasting love surrounding him. Still broken at the end of the story, he takes a deep breath. I wipe off his face. And he says these words as his pain is replaced. I I'm angry, and I'm hurt. I'm disappointed, and I feel alone. Tell me, what's the point of living this life when I feel like my life has no worth? So I'm done taking the back seat. It's time for someone else to drive. So today, I'm changing control. Today, 